having the DSP allows us to create filters to compensate for specific positions in a room. So whether it's on the meter bridge of your mixing console or soffit mounted or in a corner against a wall. Having a DSP allows us to do that far more accurately. So we can use a number of uh, biquads or filters um, to, to alter the frequency response. And then far more complicated than just a simple shelf. You know, a lot of uh, manufacturers, you know, put a, a shelf filter in, you know, for when it's up against a, a wall or in a corner. And the acoustic response is far more complicated than that. And what we are able to do is model what that response is and then create a filter to compensate for that. And having the very powerful DSP allows us the, the space to do that. When you switch the switch in, then it loads that EQ uh, and then that's then fixed as, as part of the audio flow in the speaker. Uh, and part of the switches are you can turn all over all of those off uh, and just have no filters in there other than the crossover. So if you want to use your own uh, you know, room adapting system or whatever, just set it to anechoic and free and you're away. If you don't have a, a system controller with all the bells and whistles, then you can just plug the speaker in flick the switches and know that the response is going to be okay.